So a patient will have already been diagnosed with melanoma based on their biopsy, typically from their dermatologist. And once we've confirmed that they have melanoma, if their tumor meets characteristics to test the sentinel lymph node, we will test their lymph node and remove it at the time that we remove their primary tumor. So a patient will get a procedure in the radiology suite known as a lymphocentigraphy. That is the process by which we inject a radioactive dye into their melanoma. That radioactive dye will travel from their skin to that sentinel lymph node, the lymph node that we think will have melanoma in it if the melanoma has spread. Now that radioactive dye is detectable by a gamma probe that we have in the operating room. So a patient will come to the operating room and, uh, and I will find that sentinel lymph node with the gamma probe through a small incision. Uh, I will remove the lymph node and send it to the pathologist, and the pathologist will tell us typically in a week or so whether or not there's melanoma in that lymph node. And then we'll remove the primary melanoma at the same time.